My name is Randy Reed and I'm with Luxum and I'm here to discuss light emitting plasma and to show you our lamp which I'm holding in my hand which is a replacement for the 400 watt metal halo. You may be thinking well how does LEP compare with LED technology? Well we compare very favorably and here's why. It would take approximately 220 high brightness LEDs to have the same light output as one of our light emitting plasma lamps. Our light emitting plasma lamp is available in three different CRIs, 75, 80, or 95. Our lamp is rated for 50,000 hours, and that's at L70, meaning at the end of life, which would typically be about 12 years, you're going to have 70% maintained lumens. Although the dosing of the lamp is very sophisticated and complex, mechanically, light emitting plasma is really quite simple. There are only three components, a power supply, a driver, and an emitter. Now we have 120 volts coming in from the wall, and we're converting that to 28 volt DC. That's what the power supply does. The driver takes that 28 volt, it focuses the energy into the emitter, and there are two small antennas in the emitter. They receive that energy in a very small space, and they turn the metals into gas. Right now we're at a gas state. In about 10 more seconds, we're going to fill the room with beautiful, brilliant white light as it converts to plasma. And right now, we're getting that plasma state. And the room has filled up. Light emitting plasma, a very simple device because there are just these three components. A power supply, we have a driver, and an emitter. The power supply converts the energy from the 120 volt to the 28 volt DC, and then these are just heat sinks. I'm Randy Reed with Luxum. This is Light Emitting Plasma. For more information or to purchase, go to goodmart.com.